Homeless encampments in New York are being targeted by a new initiative. City officials confirm a task force is giving out notices to vacate the areas while also offering support. CBS 2's Kieran Dillon was there as the mayor detailed the plan. Describing cardboard boxes and makeshift tents as inhumane living conditions, Mayor Eric Adams says the city is cracking down on homeless encampments. I'm not going to have an inhumane city that allows people to live in an inhumane, dangerous environment, no restrooms, no showers, no, no ways to take care of themselves. At an event Saturday, the mayor announced a two-week blitz of the camps is well underway. A task force made up of officials, including NYPD members, is currently visiting more than 100 150 locations. Officials with body cameras are offering shelter along with mental health and addiction services to residents before giving them a 24 to 48 hour notice to vacate. We're going to dismantle those encampments, give people wraparound services, voucher their goods so no one's supplies are, are removed from them. The initiative is being met with mixed reactions from New Yorkers and comes just weeks after the mayor launched an aggressive plan to remove the homeless from the subway system. This is the only way they, they, they get out of the streets because that's their home, the tent. So I, I guess it's forced them to go to go somewhere else better. It's their lives, it's their call, I think. Certainly if they're offering them services that they don't want or would rather stay in their encampment, they probably have a good reason for that. Homeless advocates are also weighing in. The Coalition for the Homeless has criticized the plan, calling it tired and cruel. In a statement, the group said in part, if the mayor is serious about helping homeless people, he needs to open thousands of new safe haven and stabilization rooms and offer them to those in need, not take away what little protection they have from the elements and other dangers on the street. The mayor responded saying, We want them in shelters. The shelters are extremely safer for people who are homeless. There is no way, there's no way you guys are telling me y'all think it's okay for people to live in a shanty box. I just can't believe that. As for the initiative, the city says the task force does plan to return to the locations of the dismantled encampments to ensure they have not been rebuilt. Meantime, the two-week blitz of the camps should wrap up by the end of the month. In Hell's Kitchen, Karen Dillon, CBS 2 News. And the mayor's office says the task force has already visited half of the encampments since March 17th.